but we got somebody who saw it. What's up, it's your girl Anadia back with another video, and today I'm gonna be DMing basketball YouTubers until someone DMs me back. Let's start off with Lolo Fitzmo. Oh my gosh, I messaged her before. Hey girl, we should 1v1 sometime for YouTube. Let's see if she messages back. Okay, then we're gonna message Brie Green, Brianna Green. I've messaged her before. Okay, I think um, I call her my twin. I call her my twin, cause we both light skin. Nah, you know who's really my twin? Chriso, but that's all I'm gonna try. All right, I'm gonna say, hey, B, Brie. So I'm gonna say, hey, Brie. Let's get a 1v1 going for YouTube. Hit me up when you're ready. <laughs> there we go. All right, so we got Bree. Let's do Carson. Let's see, what have I said to Carson? Oh, I've DM'd her before about something else. Kind of something similar. All right. Carson. I'm going to say, Carson, you ain't been in the gym. But, no, no, no. I'm not going to say that. <laughs> I'm going to say, Carson. Carson, why haven't we 1v1 yet? You scared? There we go. That's a little funny, but it's also like 1v1 me. Oh my gosh, I thought someone messaged me back. Wow, that was crazy. I'm gonna just message Zach. Zach, let me spell his name right. Zach, you're an old head now. I. <laughs> Could beat you easy, easy, easy in a 1v1. Run it? Question mark? <laughs> These people are never going to see my message. So I could just literally say whatever I want and it won't matter. Oh, I know this girl from TikTok. I don't really know her. Kid, we're going to message her anyway. Whenever you're ready for the 1v1, let's go. Whenever you're ready for the 1v1 on YouTube, let's go. I'm so awkward. I'm so awkward in these intros. She lives in Charlotte too, so this is a must. This is a must happen. This 1v1 needs to happen. I'm close to Charlotte, so that, that needs to happen. So now let's go Cam Wilder. Cam, you can't hoop. 1v1 me. Or are you scared? <laughs> Okay, Tristan. <clears throat> Bro, those trick shot layups, trick shot lays won't help you in a 1v1 with me. Let's run it. <laughs> All right, YPK Ray. I'm kind of, I, I think YPK Ray would whoop me. He would absolutely destroy me, but for fun. Let's go. You never play serious against girls. Well, I'm the girl you can play serious against and I'll still take the dub. Bet me. Let's run it. Let's run it. 
All right. I think that's a good message for YPK right now. If he sees that, he might actually respond. Okay, Cash. If you did not watch the Creator League the other day, my boy played horribly. Cash. You lost. You lost the beard. You lost your basketball skill. <laughs> I can whoop you in a 1v1. <laughs> Easily. <laughs> Some of these I'm just doing to be funny. But let's just see what happens. Okay. <clears throat> you know who I think might respond for real? Um, what's that, um, what's that guy who plays all these people who message him? I can't think of his name. Jesser, my boy. If you don't know, Jesser's my favorite. I have a, I have plenty of these Jester trading cards. He's all over my room. He inspires me. And so um, we're supposed to 1v1. We've messaged, we've talked back and forth on Twitter. He actually follows me on Instagram, which is crazy, but he never messages me back on Instagram. But whatever, we're about to send him this. Okay, so we're gonna say Jester, my boy. You haven't hit me back on Twitter, but let's get this 1v1 going. You're, let's get this 1v1 going. I know you're not scared. Nah, I ain't gonna say that, that's too harsh, that's too harsh. Okay, he doesn't know my personality. I'm gonna say, Jester, my boy, you haven't hit me back on Twitter, but let's get this 1v1 going. I'm ready. That's what I'm gonna say, that's what I'm gonna say. So I'm gonna say I'm ready so that if he's not ready, then you know, that's on him, not me, feel what I'm saying? All right, boom. Gio, I love the grind, man, but you need to 1v1 me. I'll put you on the map. <laughs> You'll lose though. <laughs> Don't know if you want that to happen. When I'm actually a big YouTuber and they see these messages like later on, I'm gonna have to apologize because they're gonna be like, bro, that's good with her. I'm gonna be like, my bad, my bad. That was back in the day. <laughs> All right, Chris, everyone sends me Chris's videos that she's my twin, so I'm gonna say twin. Twin, we need to run a 1v1. Unless you're scared. All right, y'all. So it's been about two weeks since I DM'd all these hoopers and we didn't get as many messages back as i thought i would well i didn't really think we'd get any messages back to be honest but we did get three really great messages back there was a lot of people who didn't respond at all probably didn't even see the message um didn't even look yeah never seen it never seen it never seen it never seen it Never seen it, but we got somebody who saw it. So big hooligan six six. That's a wa Crash White. I think that's what he calls himself. Let me see his profile. Crash White. <clears throat> he responded and said, "Miss, I love the confidence, but yeah, you're a baby." So I'ma just say. We're gonna have to run it while I'm in LA. We're gonna have to run it while I'm in LA. <clears throat> We're 
gonna have to run it while I'm in LA, I'll hit you. So, I don't want everyone to know. I would say after me and Jesser 1v1, we should hit a 1v1, but I don't wanna, I don't want everyone to know that I'm 1v1ing Jesser. I kinda wanna keep it low key and then it just pop off that like, yo, who is this girl? Like, who is this girl? That's how I want it to kind of be. Then I'll have a whole bunch of people lined up to 1v1, to do content with, to do fun stuff, fun ideas I've been holding out for for a long time. Um, and so all you OGs, I really appreciate all the love that y'all have shown my channel, me being a small content creator. Um, this Me not getting paid ever a dime yet to do social media. It's been a great experience just to be in front of the camera, do stuff I love for you guys. And for myself, honestly, sometimes I'm a little selfish. I just like doing content for me. And so I feel fulfilled doing this and this is why I do it. Um, we DM Kidwell. She's got 127,000 followers on Instagram. And I DM'd her and said, hey girl, whenever you're ready for the 1v1 on YouTube, let's go. We about to take over with the basketball content. Stay consistent, let's go. She actually posted something about feeling like, you know, sad some days and not knowing who she is. But I just want to help influence her. And she actually started following me on Instagram, which is crazy, but she never read my message. So I don't know really what's up with that. Like she started as soon as I messaged, as soon as I DM'd her, I think like a day later, she started following me, but she never opened my message. But she follows me, so we follow each other. And I'm not trying to do too much. We also we also follow each other on TikTok. So I'm not trying to do too much, but yeah. She's the closest basketball player to me. Because I'm in South Carolina, she's in Charlotte. It's about an hour and a half drive. And so we could really link up and make some content together. But the ball's in your court, kid. Well, hit me back up, girl. What's wrong with you? And then obviously the last person. Um, I DM Jesser and all these people. D Jesser actually DM me back, DM me back on Twitter. Anyway, it says, "Hey, I'm sorry. I hurt my knee recently preparing for the NBA All Star. Let's connect in March. Sorry on the delay." I said, "Damn, sorry to hear that. Heal up. I know you're about to be jumping to all the games in 24 hours, but sounds good. Let's go." So me and Jess are pushing for March now, which is fine. You know, we talked about it being in G in February and then we pushed it back to March. I'm thinking it will get pushed a little bit further back to like we make an exact time frame because I'm actually traveling to Korea in March. There's going to be a lot of basketball content going out and out there. And I don't know what his time frame will be, but it's if, if it's the time I'm in Korea, I won't be able to make it. So that's something to keep in mind. If you guys are hoping that it is in March, that we actually might have to push it back to like April, May. Um, but those are the three people who DM me back. Um, let's see what happens with Crash White when I'm in LA. Let's see what happens with Jester. And Kidwell, if you're watching this video, please hit me back so we can start making content here on the East Coast because you know we need it. But thank you for watching this video, guys. I hope you enjoyed. I'll see you in the next one. Peace. Hello. You see me?